Hey everybody, it's Grady at Twin Creek Audio. I'm back in the studio today to show you this mic that I dug out of the closet that I've had for a while. It's over here on this stand. It's kind of shiny on the side. And yes, it looks like a little bit like a Sennheiser 421. One of these. But it's not. It's a Sennheiser MD 412. That's 412 instead of 421 like it's big brother so I pulled this mic out to show this to you today and compare it to this one the big brother the MD 421 this is a 421 U5 not a 421 2 and it was probably made at least closer to the time that this mic was made so we'll compare these two on acoustic guitar with my ovation Standard Balladeer 1861 from 1996 and on the guitar cabinet with the 10 inch box speaker and the hot tone Britwind British Invasion channel and I'll use my art guitar number two with the single P90 pickup. I've made a lot of videos with that speaker cabinet and that guitar so that will be a good comparison. First of all I'm going to talk into the mic and let you hear what it sounds like on my voice. I do have it on the S setting for speech right now and I'll be changing that back to the M setting for music for the instrument tests and things. But let me show you what this sounds like on my voice while I show you some screenshots of specs and a picture of it that I found online. This is the Sennheiser MD-412 testing the Sennheiser MD-412. I am not using a pop filter, however, maybe I should be using a pop filter. Okay, now I've shown you the mic, showed you some cool pictures and some stuff I found online. Let's see what it sounds like. I have my 1996 Ovation Standard Balladeer Model 1861 here. I love this guitar. This guitar sounds beautiful. So I have the Sennheiser MD-412 microphone mounted here on this stand, aimed roughly at the 15th fret. Very similar to the demo I did of the Way mic versus the Shure SM57. So I'll put a link at the end of this video to that video so you can compare a Shure SM57 to this mic as well. So let's hear what this sounds like. I have the bass roll off on the mic switched to the M position so we should have full sound here. I'm using the Cappy VP26 mic preamp with the red dot op amp, the same mic preamp I used in the Way mic versus Shure SM57 video. So again, that's a good reference towards this video as well. So let's see what this sounds like. Let me switch the mics for the big brother to this mic, the Sennheiser MD-421 U5. So we can see what the difference is between the little brother and the big brother. Now using the exact same setup, except for the microphone, which I have swapped for the big brother to the Sennheiser MD-412, or at least it looks like it, it's the Sennheiser MD-421 U5. All the other setup is exactly the same and I want to remind you again I never process any of these demo files as far as the sound quality 
The only thing in any of my videos on the audio side that may get processed is the voice mic so you can understand what I'm saying. So let's see what the Sennheiser MD-421 sounds like next to its little brother, the MD-412. I'm going to flip things around and I'm going to test this Sennheiser MD-412 microphone on the custom speaker cabinet with the 10-inch Vox speaker and the Hot Tone Britwind British Invasion channel and custom art guitar number two. I have the amp set like I normally do with all the EQ set straight up, 12 o'clock flat. I have the gain up a little bit and I have the amp mic'd like this with the Sennheiser MD-412. I'm using the Cappy VP26 mic preamp with the red dot op amp just like I did in my Shure SM57 clone video the other day. So check that out for even more comparisons. So let's hear what this MD-412 sounds like on my little guitar cabinet. So that's what it sounds like. Now let me swap these mics out and let's try it with my Sennheiser 421 U5. I have swapped out the baby brother, the MD-412, for the Sennheiser MD-421 U5. Same guitar, art guitar number two, single P90, hot tone Britwind, British Invasion Channel, VP26 mic preamp. Let's see what the big brother sounds like. So that's the big brother to the MD-412, the Sennheiser MD-421. In this case, my 421 is a U5 version. Now here it is, give it another close up before I go. The bass roll off switch there, the little slot on the bottom for where the original little tripod mic stand attached. This had that little tripod stand with a clip that went in here when I first got it. I think I bought this probably around the year 2000. And I do remember using this microphone on a rap style vocal and probably on guitar amps even back then. But I haven't really used it in years. Just been put away and I think I loaned it to someone for a while. Anyway, I think it sounds pretty good. It sounds good on the guitar cabinet. It doesn't have as much low end as its big brother, the 421, and it doesn't have the same type of high end as the 421, but it does sound pretty good. And it sounds reasonably good on the acoustic guitar as well. So anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. And also, if you know anything else about this mic, about 
roughly when these were made and any other uses. I did read on a forum that there's a guy that said it sounds good as a drum room mic. It has kind of a dark room sound and it's good for that. So maybe I'll try that sometime. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a good one.